The Super Tenere is the amazing new adventure motorcycle from Yamaha, which was named for the vast region of sand in the Sahara Desert, where the famous Dakar Rally off-road race was held for many years. Yamaha won the Dakar race nine times, and this demanding race has inspired countless people to take off on their own motorcycle adventures. Everything from cross-country trips to round-the-world adventures that may take years to complete. To help you pack for your own adventure, Yamaha Genuine Accessories are offering side cases and an upper case, styled for function and to give the Super Tenere the famous Dakar race bike look. Each new Super Tenere comes standard with three separate lock assemblies that are key to the motorcycle's ignition key. These locks fit the accessory side cases and top case to provide convenient one key operation. The side cases have a unique key locking mechanism to allow you to quickly and securely attach the cases and just as easily remove them when needed. The top case has a single locking release lever. Turn the key to the left, which is labeled unlock, and the release lever will partially pop out. Pull the release lever down, which will fully disengage the case locking tab from the bike mounted rack and lift the case off. To attach the top case, insert the front tabs on the bottom front of the case into the recesses on the bike rack. Pull the release lever down and lower the case into position on the rack. Push the release lever back into the case, which will engage the locking tab into the rack on the bike, and turn the key to the center position to lock. The side and top cases also feature a tight water-resistant seal on the lids to help protect everything you need for your adventure. The lids have a multi-lip rubber sealing system that's compressed when the lid is secured to help prevent water intrusion. To open the lid, push down on the lid to relieve some of the pressure on the locking hook, which is caused by the compression of the rubber seal. Turn the key to the right, or clockwise, towards the open-close position until it stops. Do not force the key beyond this point or you may end up bending it. Hold the key in the open-close position and pull up on the lid to open. If you need to remove the key while you're loading the cases, you must rotate the key back to the center lock position. You'll feel a light detent click when the lock is in the correct position to remove the key. And you'll notice the hook is up in the lock position and you won't be able to close the lid. The cases are designed this way so you can't accidentally lock the keys inside. To close the lid, turn the key to the right to the open close position, hold the key there and push down firmly on the lid to compress the rubber seal. Now turn the key back to the center lock position and remove the key. Remember you should feel the light detent click when the lock is in the correct position. And pull up on the lid to confirm that it's securely locked. If you accidentally turn the key too far towards the attach detach position, the red lock lever on the rear of the side case and the red release lever on the front of the case may partially pop out. If this happens, don't just immediately turn the key back to the center lock position. This will cause binding in the case attachment mechanism. You'll need to first push the red release lever on the front of the case back in and hold it there while pushing the red lock lever on the rear of the case in. While holding the rear lever in, you can let go of the front lever Turn the key back to the center lock position until you feel that light detent and remove the key. To remove a side case, turn the key to the left or counterclockwise direction as you're looking at the lock assembly, which is the attach detach position. The red lock lever on the rear of the case will pop out. Pull this lever downward and the red release lever on the front of the case will then pop out. To make sure the case attachment mechanism is fully released, pull the release lever all the way out, then rotate the lever and lift the side case off the mounting bracket. To remove the key from the lock, rotate the front release lever back and push it in. While holding it there, push the rear lock lever in and hold it. You can then let go of the release lever, turn the key back to the center lock position until you feel that light detent and remove the key. To install the side case on the bike, first unlock the latch. Turn the key to the left, attach detach position. Again, the lock lever will pop out, pull it down, the release lever on the front of the case will pop out. Pull the release lever all the way out and rotate it to the open position. Install the side case onto the mounting bracket by inserting the top mount over the bracket tube and the lower mount onto the saddle. Rotate the release lever to secure the case clamp around the bracket tube and push the lever in. While holding in on the release lever, push the lock lever in and hold it. You can now let go of the release lever, turn the key to the center lock position until you feel the light detent and remove the key. Double check to make sure the side cases are secured properly and be sure to follow the loading instructions provided with the side case or top case before you take off on your adventure. 
One last thing. The Super Tenere side and top cases are built to be durable, lightweight, and to give you many years of service. If either the key lock, locking lever, or release lever seem to be binding or do not operate smoothly, stop. Don't force it. Double check things like if the side case is in the correct position, make sure the case or mounting brackets are not damaged, and that you're operating the mechanism in the correct direction. Good luck on your adventure, and thanks for watching.